Interestingly, the man who wrote Pygmalion, George Bernard Shaw, wanted Charles Lawton to play Henry Higgins in this film version. Charles Lawton. But the film's producer, Gabriel Pascal, held out for Leslie Howard. And because Pascal felt he fit the image of Higgins better and lent more of a possible romantic angle with Eliza. George Bernard Shaw is in the books, you know, as the only person to win both an Oscar and a Nobel Prize. But two others have come very close. Playwright Harold Pinter was a Nobel Prize winner in 2005, and he's twice been an Oscar nominee for writing, but never a winner. And former Vice President Al Gore won a Nobel Peace Prize in 2007, and he did appear in, also narrate and promote the Oscar-winning documentary An Inconvenient Truth, but he himself did not receive an Academy Award for it. Up next, another 1938 film nominated for Best Picture, a musical starring Jerome Power, Alice Faye, Donna Michi, and Broadway's great dynamo, Ethel Merman. Stick around. Tonight on TCM's 31 Days of Oscar, come on and see our next 1938 Best Picture nominee, Alexander's Ragtime Band. Then Mickey Rooney finds redemption at Boys Town, and Priscilla Lane strikes a sentimental chord as one of the four daughters. 